what a disaster. <laughs> Nothing has went right there. How about you? I'm Hank. Welcome to Hamiltonville Farm. I got Wiley with me today. What's up, buddy? Hey, good morning. Doing all right? Yeah, doing well, it's right. a beautiful day. They call for 80% chance of rain. I think they lied. Or they miscalculated. Let's say that. Me and you both could be weathermen. <laughs> this, this is true. So we're at this, this truck graveyard, basically. If you haven't seen all the trucks that we're fixing to work on or move around, shuffle, Wiley's got all the trucks on his channel, Don't Be Wiley. You can see how much they were, how much they're going for. You still have a couple for sale out of it? Yeah. This guy, this, oh, I got four Volvos, yes. Four got Volvos for sale. Four more Volvos for sale. So if you want to see what they look like, go check out that video over on his channel. Um, and then, so today, we're, we've got, uh, Wiley's got 10 of them sold, mm -hmm. 10, 15 of them yeah. sold. 10. And uh, so we're going to shuffle them around so they can come pick them up. They're going to piggyback them and take them down to wherever they go with the, with the trucks that they got. Yeah. So what we would like for you to do after you watch this video, is go check out some more videos on Hamiltonville Farm. You know, a lot of people ask for likes and subscribes, and that stuff's important. But the biggest signal that you can see on YouTube saying that you like this video is to watch another Hamiltonville Farm video. So go check out some more videos that we have. We would truly appreciate that. We're going to unload the T250 Bobcat, and we're going to move these things around, put some tires on them. Yeah. All that good stuff. It's probably going to be the best video you've ever seen on YouTube. Today. Today. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. That's what they use to. Oh, okay. That's what the, the piggyback system? Yeah. I guess the other side is broke off. <laughs> the rest of that front axle of that truck right there, uh, they've got, the last time that they had like, uh, coming this way, I think, and it just attaches that axle to that, That's and away cool. they go. So they're going to use this one for the haul buggy, or is this, the, no, this might be the second one or the third one, huh? Yeah, this one starts and moves, right. but they're gonna pull this these three internationals together. How that, many? Can, how many can they pull together? I think it's three is is what the, he's the, gonna the get. The toe that plus two more. Three more. Oh, so four total. Yeah, I think it's probably got something to do with the length of the trucks too. You could probably. Okay. I don't know what the law is about that. Right. But I wouldn't want to tow none. Oh uh, yeah, no, I hear you. I heard that. So that that's interesting, very interesting. So which one are we moving first? Or we, what we're gonna put tire on that one first or what Yeah, we, I, uh are yeah. You? Yes. I was uh Right. Just come up behind that Mac if you will and let's see if we can push it out. Because oh, okay. I'm gonna rob some tires off it. It don't go. Okay. But we'll rob some tires off it to put on that. Rob Peter and pay Paul. That's right. Okay. So that's the uh, 434 there. Yeah, we're going to use that for a little bit of a donor. 10 full. Hey, me and Wiley are at these trucks. And you're going to see us do a bunch of stuff. We're all sweaty. We've been working hard on it today. And I got to thinking about, uh, you'll see later in the video that I locked my keys in the truck. Well, I also think about what if my battery went dead? I'd have a jump starter right here from Top Don. It's the Jump Surge 3000. It's got seven safety pr protection measures. It's got a DC output. It's got a uh, 45 watt quick charge. It's got an LED light on it. Let's unbox it and take a look. You can actually jump nine liter gas engines and seven liter diesels with this thing. So we won't be able to we won't be able to jump the trucks that we're working on out here today. But uh, it just rip it open. Just rip it open. So this is the Top Don, and it comes in a really nice carrying case. You've actually seen us use this before. It comes in a nice carrying case. Quick connect cables here, the charger, and then the actual jump pack itself. I'll leave a link in the description, the JS3000 Top Don Jump Starter. It's a, it's a really cool unit. Go take a look at them, and thanks a lot, Top Don, for sponsoring today's video. Let's get, let's get back to work. Actually, we're going to leave. 
You're at, this this is at the end of the video, but he's my editor is going to put it at the beginning of the video because we're <laughs> we're pretty tired. All right, yeah. all right, let's get to working on these trucks. Let me throw a chain on the forks here. Or do you want Push to it closer offset. to the truck? Yeah. I'm sorry? You can get it closer to the truck. Okay.
Yeah, that one's just a tick heavier. Tick. I mean, that we, you know, beggars can't be choosers, but they, we're going to have to have something to get it off the ground. Uh, well, I mean, we're going to raise it up, take these tires off, and then yeah. repeat the process on the other side? Right. That's what the plan is. <laughs> I mean, what could go wrong? Right. <laughs> and uh, this, this truck is okay to be on the ground because we're going to cut this truck, that other Volvo, another truck we're going to put it in that trailer we're going to put motor and rear ends in that trailer wow not today hank so don't <laughs> don't go hyperventilating it's okay <laughs> but uh anyway look skaters yeah buddy yeah we upset their home didn't we yeah all right you want to take these off right quick Let me... yeah i actually bought that one out here so we could just take the tires off and get this one back off the ground and push it back in the hole okay. when we get through with it is what I did because those tires are not going to make it. Right. I don't know that this isn't going to Guatemala from here. Right. I don't know if the guys stop in Texas and redo right. it or if they go all the way. Yeah. But I'm thinking they're going to go all the way. Sure. Why not? Okay. What do you want me to do? We, you got the, you want me to go get some wrenches and stuff? Well, I just got the air compressor. I mean, let's don't do it manual since you got that nice air compressor. Okay, I'll pull the truck around. Okay. And then I'll pull the truck in front of the the Mac here. And that hose that hose will fit here easy. You know, you know and I got that um, uh, air cat. Yeah. That sucker. Well, that's the only reason I called you. Hank. I know. I know it With is. With skid steer and air cat. I know it. Air compressor. Dude, the dude and, abuses and, me all the time. And abuses. free lunch. I, I guess who, yeah, I guess who's buying lunch today. Yeah. <laughs> that's what we keep you around for i know i might be some dumb but i ain't plum dumb that's good Let's see there's six we'll make it work hank i know that is a 33 i've got a 33 half inch drive i didn't know if you had a 33 uh maybe I've got, but I also have one of those bud, bud, bud sockets, bud tire sockets. Is that not what we need? We'll see. We'll see if we're talking about the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Bud, buddy. I can't believe I actually have a service truck we can do this stuff with. Yeah. It just tickles me pink, man. Yeah. I love it. It does me too, especially on the days like today. Yeah, I understand. I wish, let's just go get those four-way lug wrench and do it the old style. Yeah, that, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to name my truck 45. What do you think? 45. Uh, I don't know what we're doing over here. Cause you're I'm, looking for a Haircat and you're looking for a 33 millimeter. They're all on the other side. All right. Watch your fingers there, boss man. Well, I'm glad you didn't cut it no closer. I couldn't have made it. <laughs> yeah, let me fix that. I'd be all right. Nah, you good. Air cats on the right side. There's that. And then the my Sun X metric impact sockets. That ain't gonna work. 36. Gotta be a deep wheel. Uh, well, we got it right here. I got a socket that'll fit that. Oh, you did? Yeah. I got the bud. I got the bud one. Where's the bud at, bud? Let me go check the other side. Oh, here it is, right here. Well, yeah, that's. Oh, that's the. Uh, what is that? I don't know. That's the thirteen six things. I got a thirty-three. I got a thirty-three. So, who wore the number thirty-three for the Dallas Cowboys? Uh. Tony Dorsett. Tony Dorsett. Ding, 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 ding. Had like a 99-yard TD run one time. All right, let me get the compressor cranked up here. I brought some pushaline. Let's see, you got to release the compression valve. There's going to be some water spit out here. Turn the choke on. Start on. All right, here we go.
Just take it. Yeah, we'll leave this one on it. <laughs> I don't think it'll make it. <laughs> All right. Oh, I forgot to put the half inch oh. air check on. All right, now she should work. Don't tell me hang that. On, hang on, hang on, hang on. It might be the wrong, I think I, oh, there it is. Yeah, perfect. Gotta retrain ourselves to say PB Blaster. Yeah, oh yeah, PB Blaster. We're just taking the outside off. It ain't a 33. What is it? Probably 35. It's either 34 or 35. Well, let's go get yours. The bud? Yeah. These are 33. Huh? These are 33 over oh. here. Yes, yeah, will work. Yeah. Air cat. That's insane, dude. Hey, let's get them when you lift up with them. Got the air hose. You get them all broke loose? Yeah, they're all broke loose. Yep. Are you going to take the other gun and just get them all the way off, or are you going to Okay, get... we could do that. Is that half inch or three quarter? That's three quarter, so. Yeah. But you got that half inch adapter right there on the end of that socket. I don't have a three quarter to half inch, because my impact is a half inch. Okay. See what I'm saying? Roger. We just have to use this. Yeah. I don't think I do. Let me check. All right. Well, I'm going to be getting these. Actually, you know what? What? I mean, you can take those off. You can go ahead and take them off, can't you? Yeah. Ah. I don't know what you're doing. Are you taking it? Oh, no, not this one. Top, but it's all right. No, it's in there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Here comes the piggybackers. It's in, it's out. I'm not sure I could pick the front up to move it back. Huh? I, I don't know if I could pick the truck up, front of the truck up to push it back. 
No, we're gonna put uh, another old tire up here. Okay. What are you doing? You taking these off? You zipping them off? Yeah. What's this after? Uh. Yeah. 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 I'll get this, uh, Do we have another inch or three quarter to half? Yeah. Now. Watch out, I got you. Oh, come on. Look at that. I see that. Well, that's not good. No. No bueno? Uh, ten. Yeah. Uh. All right, here's what's going on. We took the Mac out. This is a, this is a lesson learned. Um, the, the Mac has eight lug nuts. The International has ten. And we broke a, an adapter, a three-quarter, I mean, an inch to three-quarter adapter. I broke two of them, as you saw earlier in the video. So we're going to, Wiley went to go buy the adapters and some water because it's about 6,000 degrees out here. And so we're going to put the Mac, we're going to put the wheels back on the Mac, put it back in its grave, <laughs> and, uh, and then find another international to pull out here with tin lug that will fit on there. And obviously the reason why we're putting the wheels on it is so they can transport it. I mean, that's, that's why we're doing that. So anyway, so let's get the wheels back on this Mac, and Wiley will be back in a sec. Hey. Hey, we're going to put the 
the and we're gonna put the uh, Mac back in the hole. We're gonna put the tires back on the Mac, put it back in the hole. Okay, I'm on my way. All right, bye. <laughs> Yeah, are Just enough to roll it, and so we'll put this on top. Okay. All right. Just we can just roll them back. We can these. We'll just roll back. Okay. See, which I just don't know what other truck Wiley wants to pull out, or we would pull it out and get you know start taking the tires off. I called him, he said he'd be here in just a second, so when he gets here, he can tell us which tires to take off. About one or two, maybe on the back side of that one, huh? Two on the back side of that one. Get me back here, get me snake bit. Yeah, I mean, we got six there, yeah. Oh. Is he only taking one truck today? Well, I'm trying to get three trucks 
with tires on them. <laughs> and I thought, well, that's one. Well, there ain't two trucks with tires on them. One of them's got them on there. Instead of dragging them out, can I lift them up, take the tires off, and then just carry well, the I'm tires gonna, over? I'm cutting them out, and I just didn't want to cut them on that tarp. Oh. Catch that tarp on fire. And <clears throat> I know the tarps ain't no good, but that's the only reason I was dragging the ones I was going to cut out. Mm. Was the Mac one you was going to cut? No, I was going to drag it back. Oh. Okay, I did that already. Don't have the tires. These aren't, these aren't uh, eligible for, we can't, we can't steal from them? Yeah, but there ain't none up there either. If you haven't seen the video of us cranking that RV right there, that thing catches on fire when we're cranking it. Go check it out. Here's two. So all we got to have, we got to have two for that one. Got to have one for that one. Got to have one for that one. It's four. And got to have... Just might as well say eight. Got to have 12 tires. But there's two on the front of that one. That'd bring it to 10. And I think there's two on the front of the other international. I'd bring it to eight. Just got to have eight tires because front tires could come off and go on the back. Yeah. Anyhow, I'm about tired of walking around and get something going. Well, you tell me. You may lift up that international over there and get those tires. Right. International's going. Okay. But, but we got to have it to move around. It's got to move around because we got to somehow or another, somebody's got to come up here and lift the front uh -oh. and hook up. Then the tires will come off. Yeah, how are you going to get them on top of each other? <laughs> They're going to have to get something up here to do that with. All we'd had to have was six. This is, uh, you know, this is what I didn't want to have to do. Truck down to that second trailer. Pull this truck. Yeah. Between the two trailers down there. That says Pierce on it? Yeah. Or the... Go right in between them. Okay. There's a... We're going to have to just take a jack and take those trailer tires off. You uh, take, we can take the skid steer down there too? I'm not sure that skid steer lift the trailer. It's got some stuff in it. Oh, okay. You can try it if you want to go ahead and try it. Because it's got a bumper get on one side. And, yeah. But I don't think so. That's right there in the mud hole, didn't it? Does anything ever go as planned? Not with hanging wild it, don't. This one's probably a 33 too. 33 millimeter. Well, that's it for the old PB blaster. We just pull it around there and take the tires off right beside the wheel. Okay. Jeez. Hey, can he drive up onto that rim, uh, on, like on the front, then we take the back off and then? We can certainly try it. I ain't against it. Okay. Go, 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 go. Does that matter that that red thing's on there? Yeah. That's what the other one's telling him now, I think. Hitch. Yeah. Oh, it just comes off with the kingpin. Oh, no tools required. That's awesome. Gotta have the crank. Oh Lord. Well, maybe he can get enough on his airbags.
You gotta have a crank. You run a screwdriver through it. Okay. Uh, you need Phillips? Yeah, Phillips. Well, don't be popping wheelies on that. We got work to do. <laughs> uh, he don't know what color. He don't know what color hose to put on there. Is what he's saying. And he's selling the yeah. red. He's saying the red goes to the red. Yeah. You only need the service brake. Try that. Try that. Hit your, hit your brake. It's going to the back. I hear it. Huh? I hear it in the back. All the way to the truck. Uh, Ooh, they stuck like Chuck. Airline? Air? No, no air? Oh, what a disaster. You, you know how it's free in the corn? Free in the corn? Uh, yeah. Can I get one? Uh, Are you in the corn? Yeah, it's got air. Push, push the brakes. It's got air lines. This way. Oh. oh, he's going to cage the brakes. Yeah. Tell him to come on. Let me go get some uh, boards for the jack. Oh, you ruined the trolling motor. We can't go fishing now. <laughs> okay. Well, it's out of air now anyway. Uh, it still got something. Okay. I said it was out of air. Where's the, where's the adjustable wrench? Here. Okay. You can let go now. I got it. You can put the yeah. Oh, you're just wasting air. No, oh, you're just wasting air. I don't know about the driver. How about you, driver? Then we got to change it back to take the. I know. <laughs> yep, that's a fact, Jack. Need a little old short thing that'll go into yeah. that and reduce the. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. You know what I mean? All right, let me, let me turn the pressure on. I 
coming out of these four holes right here. You got a jack handle? Bring the 33, yep, 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 yep. Crank this back up. That's not the 33. Take it off with the bobcat. Okay. I'll get the bobcat over here. Yeah. Carry him, yeah. You get one? Yeah. No. Uh, no. No. We're fixed. Got no. No? Is it? Yeah. It's good. We'll put air in. Okay. We'll get these. We don't have much choice. <laughs> huh? Hey, is that other one up? This one or not? That's you? Those up? Okay, let's go there. Good. 
Okay, watch out. next time. Yeah. Hey, uh, 
So, what you didn't see for the last hour probably is uh, my, I left my keys in my truck running and the truck running and the door's locked. So we've been fighting that for about an hour. I'm gonna single these out. Single these out, uh, try to single those out. And the top, then uh, all we got to do is just, it'd be easy to run them on blocks and you don't put the yeah. tires on there. So there you have it. I'll lift this up with the Bobcat. We'll get them on and, and there you have it. Or, yeah. You wanna put them on the inside duels, don't yeah. you? Yep, 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 yep. Ten four. Man, it's been a long day. It has been. Nothing was, has nothing has went right. Nothing. Nothing. But you're used to seeing that, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Except yeah. maybe one time. <laughs> we might have a jewel in there yeah. somewhere. We might have one out of three hundred. Yeah. All right. You need the air cap? Yeah. Thirty three. Yep. We'll finish up putting these tires on. And then the next video, hopefully, actually on Wiley's channel, you'll probably show him getting loaded up, huh? Yeah. Yeah, so make sure you subscribe to Wiley, see him getting loaded up. <laughs> Come on. You'll put those on the inside? No. All right. Hey, you want to do this? I'll do that. Okay. Those two up front will go there. I guess we can pair these out and be done with it. All right. You need a pair of pliers to turn that tw switch? I got them. You got it? I got my pliers. <laughs> Thank you. 
okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And those two over there. Those two over there. Those two up front goes on the back. Okay. Uh, so those? Uh. <laughs> and then you'll have to turn it up when you need your hydraulic to look.
Is that it with the air hose? Yeah. I'm gonna start cleaning it. Wiley, I'm beat. No, he didn't nothing go well today. Nothing went right at all. But that's okay. Don't forget, you can check out the loading, the, the, when they actually piggyback these trucks, we'll put it on Wiley's channel. That's how we kind of do this. Set. We, you know, Wiley showed him buying it. We showed me working on it a little bit. And then Wiley, we show you loading it up and those guys getting down. It's super nice young men. Yeah. Uh, they were really cool. We used Google Translate a lot today. Hand signals. And hand signals, Google. He called Wiley number one a couple times. <laughs> Listen, watch some more Hamiltonville Farm videos. We'd appreciate that. That sends the big signal to YouTube that you like it. All right, you guys take care. God bless you guys.